Alright guys, Nemesis Z here bringing you another video from the Hard Time server. Uh, today we are finishing up at least the TNT shop for now. As you can tell, I added a few few things. I added some glowstone. No. It's on me, obviously. Trying to make it a little kind of modern lighting in here. And need another one right about here. Actually, no, that'll be. much in the way. There. I think that should light everything up. And up here I did a little room, a little table, some ceiling fans. Need to add a couple chairs to that. So I was cooking me some nether brick. Add some chairs. Add bench seating. What bench seating? Let's leave the plane. I don't know if this room needs anything else. I mean, it's kind of just what it is right now. I think it needs a stove, though, that's for sure. Um, cobble? Yes, we do. Stoves, oh, furnaces, and that blends in a little bit too much of those. Hmm. I don't know. I think it's complete in here. So yeah, that's what I got. I'm trying to go torchless, at least in here. And today we're going to work on the parking lot a little bit too. I know this is actually going to be like a couple days of uh, work. so good. Uh, basically learned a little trick with uh, carpeting and signs. Basically what you do is place your signs down, place some carpet over it, bam! Instant lines. So I don't happen to do too much. See parking spots, you know, it could be a little wider. Uh, yeah, make them at least too wide.
Yeah, cause the key thing is you got to have them with the, the stick, because otherwise, if you do that, it doesn't show through. So basically, it's because of that a little bit, a little edge it pops up. Basically, voila. Uh, right. Two matter, and we're going to be able to read them. They're underground. Just like that. And also, if you wanted to do other things, like there. Yeah, so basically, it's how to do that. That way, I don't have to actually go get some white wool and put lines down, and it'll be, you know, thick. This way, they're thinner. You know, park your horse or whatever kind of thing, but you know, the horse will walk off. But just kind of, you know, imaginary if you had cars or whatever. So, yeah. Uh, next trick is to get. Well, I need to still put up the like the signs for in here. Uh, or the menu board or whatever you want to call it. Done a little work in here and got some counters up. Got chests in. Uh, what I'm gonna sell in here, I don't know. So what I was trying to do was uh, for like some window shopping. Uh, here I'll show you that. Just some regular glass. For that. I was trying to do, you know, it's like oh, I want the, you know, so. Suppose say I'm selling, you know, that. Obviously I'm not. But I wanted to do that, but they pop off. Let's see. It takes a little bit, but it, they eventually do pop off. And same way with when uh, the other glass, because it's connected, it's... It, makes it pop off, which I wish it didn't. It's because it connects to the wall or anything else. It'd have to be nothing behind it with another block. And then you have the window shopping or whatever. And we got the counter in here with the dark gray carpet which matches the Scion fairly well. So I got three chests in here, and then I got uh, quartz flooring, which I didn't uh, do. You know, I'll tell you this is the uh, pillar. This is the pillar sideways with a pattern, and then in here I have the chiseled, uh, which gives it that look. Uh, the sides are different too, but the, the that's the top of it. So yeah. Um, to do in this one. Like right now I was just waiting for it to get dark to see how well lit this place is. I'll try to do one of these numbers. 10, 11, 12, there's 9, there's 8, 7, I need some more lighting in here so to not completely have stuff spawn. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do that. So I'm trying to not disrupt this up here too much. Is this in front of that chest, isn't it? Yeah. That would be. Or the. 
chairs are. Not liking, not liking at all. Something like that, maybe. So, I mean, that'll give me the light that I need. Doesn't give me. I just don't want plain glowstone sitting there. I did make up some redstone lamps. Let's see how that looks. Just gonna make some torches. Put under there. Down. Not too bad. I like there's some doors on there. That adds a little bit more. Then it makes it look something like that. Right now I'm running. I'm not running the snapshot, so I'm not. I need. Can't have the iron uh, trapdoors. I might just leave them like they are. I think that's probably my best bet. Torches. There we go. Yeah, I got chests buried here right now <clears throat> just to have not my way. All my materials. Sure, I'll also put those back. All right, that's good. That's good. So, I mean, this is a corner right here, but it's block lighting of nine, so nothing should spawn. Everything in here is lit really well, so stairs don't matter because nothing spawns on stairs yet. Always one of these times that stuff might spawn, you never know. But for now, they don't. I could add the last two right here. Even it out. I don't know, guys. Uh, so hopefully, we get some people wanting to join the server at some point. Or small YouTubers, or good size, or whatever. Doesn't matter. You know, if you're just starting out, or Whatever, and you look for a server. Alright. So there's that. It's definitely well lit in here now. So even in here, it's tens, nines. Yeah. Out here in the half slabs, of course. Different story. 
Like right now, I just got everything lit up with torches. But I need to definitely get some more cyan clay and some more lime clay, lime green. Somebody's car alarm's going off. Not mine. I don't have a car, a car alarm. My car's POS, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. We'll need more. Uh, hopefully we can get like a pig man or something in here. Not me. Uh, get that trapped in here. And then... Get another guy trapped in here, and this one would be the one I'll run, obviously. So, so I don't. I left it like this, so I'll be like, oh, hey, how's it going? Oh, you would like something? Okay, I have da -da 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 today. Whatever the shop you're gonna be. Yeah, as you can see. We got how many green? We got some cactuses growing over there though, so I'm gonna get some green, bake some up, maybe some cyan. Maybe the other thing. Oh, that's what I could get. Duh, some paintings. Always forget about paintings. We got some bookshelves. What else? Um, that. I don't want. Also an odd number right there too. Hmm. Hmm. So I covered up that window. It's three. Two. Symmetry, damn it, symmetry. There. Much better. You can see out the full window. All right. Um. Really? Get in there. And we have that. So basically, the TNT shop will be selling gunpowder and uh, TNT. There you go. You know what's selling, kind of. Come up to the counter and be like, I would like something. I need to pay. Bam. Otherwise. These chests are just going to be for looks, there's going to be nothing in them. Because uh, I'm actually going to glass it off. Except for probably right here. Because, uh, you know, you go into banks now and they got like the plexiglass, that's what this is going to be. Not only for the teller protection, but uh, for, you know, your protection, I guess, kind of thing. So. See what else? What else? What else? What else? Um, oh, I got cyan right there. I need more cyan. Die. See, I'm really good at Minecraft apparently lately. I've been doing stuff like, oh man, oh, I need a shovel. Yeah, there's actually a shovel in my inventory this whole time. 
Okay at math, but I'm bad at Minecraft apparently lately. I think this is going to be my butcher shop. And this one I plan on making a record store out of it. Cyan clay. Probably wondering why he's like, man, you're taking damage. Like, yeah. Got my beacon right there. I'm still in range, which is good. Makes me happy. It just makes me sad now. To use the ladders. I have ladders. I've just been doing random stuff also on the server. Um, cleared out more of the desert. Plan on starting a PvP project there too. It's going to take a while to get it done. I said this is going to be my record store. Pigman working it. The zombie pigman working it. Oh, wonderful. Sorry, work next door. I don't know if you guys can hear that. Let's should probably tell a story, right? Let's go with how I got into Minecraft. Like, I don't know, I've been playing for, I don't know, quite a few years now. And I've been playing since uh, 1.3.2 after beta, after alpha and all that. So I know there's like a... 1.3 alpha and a 1.3 beta or something like that. Or, I don't know. Not 100% sure. Got into it. Had, uh, kept hearing about it. Kept hearing about it. And everybody's like, oh. A couple friends are like, oh man, you, sh you know, you should get into it. You know, it's good, it's good. I'm like, I don't know. And, you know, I just kind of went with it. I'm going to add some bookshelves in here. Kind of dress it up a little bit more. Uh, right. Looks like they read in here at least a little bit. I don't. I know I got 
four iron. We're gonna six iron. Four. A high iron bar in here somewhere. I use it. What I use it for. I guess I did not have a iron. So, a couple bushes in the corner. Lamps in there. With these. But yeah, <clears throat> got into Minecraft. Uh, sitting there, you know, I kept hearing about, it, hearing about. It. Like I had a couple friends. It's like, oh man, you should play it. It's amazing. It's amazing. I'm like, all right, whatever. Never really did get into it until I downloaded the, the free demo from uh, was it, uh, I want to say it's like Game Informer or IGN or one of them like basically they had uh, had a free demo of it so I was like alright I'll give it a try With, let's go with red counter. Yeah. That makes a little sense. I think this is a butcher shop. Um, yeah, so I was trying the demo, and like basically it lasted a, a night and day cycle. Like, I was playing it for hours and hours on end. And that's pretty much how I get into a lot of games. I'll play the demos and just finally get to the point where it's like, alright, screw this. I gotta, you know, play the real thing. And so I was playing the hell out of the demo. And finally just, you know, decided to buy it when I had some cash. And because I bought it during a point when I had no actual, actual job. I was just uh, basically working at home, uh, selling my crap on eBay, so paying my bills that way, and then stumbled across, started watching uh, server videos and stuff like that of different YouTubers, and just finally got to the point where it's like, all right, fine, I'll. Uh, Join a server, you know. I had my single player world and I kind of got bored of that. I was like, okay, I wouldn't mind having some other players, but then, like, started, you know, seeing a lot of the other. Oh. I don't know if that's too much green or not. not. Let's go with a darker green spruce uh, but yeah you know I was like joining the server and I started seeing like briefing videos and stuff like that and I'm like oh boy this ought to be interesting you know how, how long your stuff will last and end up joining the family game night server uh, which is currently closed now I don't know how long or till when or whatever playing on that and started doing some crazy stuff. The moderators at the time were like wondering how how like I was 
how I was building, or you know, they thought I was using like World Edit and stuff like that. Cause I was, using, yeah, that's nicer. I was using, uh, you know, I was, I was built a sphere. You know, I've, uh, well, it was half a sphere. I didn't, I didn't fully make it a sphere, sphere, because I was gonna like put something on the top of it. I still got that world. I used a uh, world downloader to get a copy of it. But uh, so I sit there and I uh, playing on there, doing my own thing, and so I finally oh, I got seeds. But uh, yeah, I started doing that. And like I said, the, the moderators thought I was using World Edit, and they're like, you know, they're trying to figure out how I was creating things, and I just uh, learned, you know, just how to do things. Eight. So I gotta put in at least some other lighting. But, yeah, so I was, um, so yeah, I was, uh, I, I think I've showed it in one of my world tours, there you go, that'll be the menu board or whatever. And so I uh, was doing that, uh, and then they had like shops and stuff where you can buy blocks from. So I was constantly always buying blocks and stuff. And they like thought I was hacking because I had actually like a uh, currency, all that kind of stuff. And they thought I was uh, moderator at the time thought I was hacking that in or something. It's like doing everything completely legit. And you know they're like, how you know how's he doing it without fly? How's he doing it? You know, they were just, they were just confused and dumbfounded, which I I found hilarious. You know, once I actually uh, met him, started talking to him a little bit, and was laughing my ass off. It's like, man, you know, I thought you were hacking. I thought you were doing this. Like, no, man. I can, uh, if I want to build weird things, I will build weird things. Shit, there's a ghost down there. Over. And, so I mean, that's how I kind of got, uh, kind of got started. I mean, it's just, the friends now that said that uh, you know play let's play Minecraft and all that they pretty much stopped. They're on to other things now, other games. Off the moon, add a glowstone here. See again, I have a shovel, but yet I'm not using it. Stone should be uh, right there. That we will right there. Do I want it? Try to move it over. No, I think that should be. Okay, we'll just add it. Yeah, we'll just add it. Yeah, so I played on that server for quite a while. I became a moderator on it, and I, I know I got some videos of it uh, on my channel. So, all over by one. It's chest.
It's loaded with crap. I do with the dirt. But yeah, I mean, <clears throat> it's just something you know, find enjoyable now. It's that was stress relief. I played uh, played MMOs a lot, and I just you know I haven't gone back to an MMO for a while now. Uh, started with uh, EverQuest one, and then worked my way to WoW, and then played so many that I've lost track of the names and. Stuff, so, you know, Minecraft is one of the things I haven't yet quit. Like I, like I, I'll get bored and I'll pick back up, and I get bored and I'll, you know, pick it back up. But I mean, with me putting videos out now, I find it more enjoyable to like just grab it, you know, and start playing again. And so it's it's something I've been doing, you know, keeps me busy. So yeah, there's that. Yeah, I don't know if you noticed I had windows up here. I'm sure you did. One with the the white stained glass, obviously. Yeah. Um, I don't know. That's kind of a tutorial how to do like different. Patterns. And I mean, it, you stand on it and stuff, so. It's like a, you can do, I don't know, other things, but I think this is going to call it an episode. Uh, still got a little bit more to do, uh, roofing wise. Uh, I think I'll finish that in the next video. And then we'll start working on the uh, PvP area, which I'll show you real quick. So basically, it's, I don't know why I'm not rendering a lot of stuff lately. I don't understand it. Most of these chickens are here because of me. No chickens. Yeah, dug out more of it. I think it was so about where that gray block was, or a little bit there, and I just dug out the rest. So a lot of it's getting just rotting away. But when I get a chance, I've been building chests and trying to store most of it. It's, uh, John Marks was helping me slab it with the half slabs. So I was helping me get uh, so far some of it done. I haven't uh, actually done anything of myself. I've just been wiping out the, the desert. Because uh, in my other videos I had a, a bigger bigger mountain here and I uh, TNT'd it down which that was, that's part of it. It was, it was pretty high. About as high as that one. Uh, 
uh, but all stone and uh, sand and the uh, sandstone. So blew that up. Uh, didn't video it. I don't know why I didn't, but uh, been fun to have explosions. I still need to blow some of this out, blow that one out. So I'm just trying to clear out this desert for some PvP arenas. So hopefully once I start getting the PvP stuff up, uh, people that are whitelisted will rejoin and actually start doing things again. Otherwise I know I'm going through tools pretty fast, uh, doing stuff like that. But yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Hope you you know like, subscribe, all that stuff. Uh, Till next time, guys. Uh, have a good one.